Hey everybody, so I have a bit of a different uh, product unboxing today. Today I'm going to be unboxing the Yu-Gi-Oh! Speed Duel Starter Deck Match of the Millennium. So you got Yu-Gi and uh, Maximilian Pegasus there. So I actually kind of just had this interest reignited in Yu-Gi-Oh! So I've kind of kind of a lot but what's happened is basically i started to look at what was available and i saw this xyz pendulum things i really couldn't understand and it just seems so different from the Yu-Gi-Oh that i remembered so i went out and my local store so happened to carry one of these so i figured let's just take a look and see how it works so with speed duels from what i understand it's similar to dual links which is an app you can get on the ios and the the google stores google play stores it's a simplified version of Yu-Gi-Oh! that is more akin to what was seen in Battle City, Duelist King, not, not Duelist Kingdom, didn't really follow any rules, but Battle City and onwards until the end of the Yami, Yugi, Kaiba uh, saga, that kind of thing. Um, so anyways, in this particular package, it comes with two decks, one Yugi-themed deck, and the other one is Pegasus-themed. And I think these decks are kind of bit well at least the pegasus deck is based on mainly his duelist kingdom cards and this one um this will be actually quite interesting so without further ado let's just really see so it says uh two decks 62 common cards two ultra rare variant cards four skill cards one double-sided deluxe game mat okay so the usual and the thing about speed duel cards is they are a little different uh, in terms of their aesthetics compared to the regular tcg cards uh, from what I've from what I've read, uh, so if I'm wrong, you know, forgive me. Um, but aside from that, what I understand is you can actually use speed duel cards in the regular card game. But again, I'm that's a little too advanced for me. I'm just gonna open this up here. This is really nostalgic. The last time I opened one of these was actually a starter deck Pegasus, many 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 years ago. So box is out. You have the dual mat right here. Take a quick look at that. Ooh, upside down. Okay. So, we've got Pegasus, Yugi, the Speed Duel branding. Now you notice there's only three zones, three monster and three spell and trap zones. And you got Merrick and Bakura. Yeah. I like how they also now call it the GY instead of the graveyard for all you veterans. Uh, GY is such new lingo. <laughs> okay, maybe it's just me. And here is some rules. I think this will be really helpful for people who aren't familiar with the series, or maybe they're not too familiar with the rules, if they were playing the game their own way, kind of like how we do with Uno. And we have the two decks. So, they're nicely packaged in a bit of plastic wrap. Let's be nice and gentle there. There we are. Two decks. So we have the Pegasus and the Yugi deck. We will start with... Let's get a little close-up of those. So we'll start with the Pegasus deck. Um, it's funny, when I was younger, actually, I got the starter deck Yugi first, then starter deck Pegasus. Never had the enjoyment of owning the red eyes black dragon or the blue eyes white dragon. Um, so I guess that continues here. Oh, oh well. So I'm just gonna open it, a little bit of plastic wrap. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, we can tear this. We'll We'll take care of these cards right after that. We'll just go through what cards are come in the pack. Okay, so we have this top piece, which is just a little advertisement. It tells you that this is the Pegasus deck. And we have, sorry, slight allergies. DD Crow, so Different Dimension Crow, Thousand Eyes Spell. These are skill cards. These are used in speed duels. Um, they have various effects. Okay, so we're getting to the cards. We have a Thousand Eyes Idol, Illusionist Faceless Mage, Toon Alligator, Red Archery Girl, Manga Riran, Toon Barrel, ooh, I haven't seen this guy before, Toon Barrel Dragon. Interesting, um, the art looks more like pistols, which is actually what the original Barrel Dragon was, until four kids changed it to more of a non-pistol, non-adult theme. Got Toon Buster, Bl oh, another interesting guy, Toon Dark, oh, I haven't seen him. Some, this was in Starter Deck Pegasus. These guys, Toon Mass Sorcerer. Mass Sorcerer, that's an interesting pick. Another one, Toon Gemini Elf. Oh, okay, we'll hover on that for a little bit. 
Illusionist Faceless Mage. Okay, so this is like a, this is, a, I think they call them a retrained version of Illusionist Faceless Mage. Sonic Bird came in the original. Uh, Jin Prog, Prognosticator of Rituals. Prognosticator. Mm hmm. Jin Disser, dis, Disser, Jin Disserer of Rituals. Okay, whatever that is. Relinquished. This guy. Black Illusion Ritual, Tune World, Tune Table of Contents, Tune Rollback, Polymerization, Fulfillment of the Contract, Tune Mask, Seven Tools of the Bandit, Dust Tornado, Shield Spear. I'm not really interested in trap cards. Skill Successor. And of course, if we have Thousand Eyes Idol and we have his friend Relinquished, then we're definitely going to have Thousand Eyes Restrict. Always thought this guy looked a bit crude. Maybe it's just me. Okay, cool. That nice uh, hollow DD Crow. Okay, so we'll put that back down. And time for the Yugi deck. This is actually quite nostalgic. Some of those cards I had owned before. I'd have to go dig them up again, but they probably aren't in as great of condition as I'd like them to be. Quite a few were new. I guess they were, you know, added at some point. Feel free to comment if you know more about it than I do. You probably do. Um, but really nostalgic. Okay, so we got Yugi with his Black Luster Soldier. More info again. Advanced Ritual Art. Ooh, that is a very nice looking card. Get that in the camera. Rituals of Black Mastery, Knight of Legend. And I think those are the only skill cards. Okay. So, in terms of monsters, in terms of the regular deck, we got Dark Magician, Guy of the Fierce Knight, Curse of Dragon, those two, of course, form a polymerization card, fusion card, Winged Dragon, Guardian of the Fortress number one, Beaver Warrior, oh, classic Celtic Guardian, or Celtic Guardian, Silver Fang, Giant Soldier of Stone, Shadow Spe- ooh, this is different, I haven't seen this guy before. Charging Guy of the Fierce Knight, Senju with a Thousand Hands, Old Vindictive Magician, this looks like an old version of the Dark Magician that Arcana used from Battle City. Karibo, Magician of Faith. Sphere Karibo. Interesting. Never seen this guy before. Black Luster Soldier, of course. Black Luster Ritual, Polymerization, Soul Release. This actually used to be in Starter Deck Pegasus. Interesting that it's swapped. Spell Shattering Arrow, Spiral Spear Strike, Twister, Summoner's Art, Fighting Spirit, White Elephant's Gift, Goblin Circus, Backup Squad, Spellbinding Circle, Classic Card, Magic Jammer, also was in Starter Deck Pegasus, it's changed, uh, Eliminating the League, and Gaia the Dragon Champion. Hmm. Definitely missing some monsters and... Too bad they weren't, they didn't include the retrained versions, like, uh, was it Obnoxious Celtic Guardian? With that really powerful effect that he couldn't be destroyed in battle. Um, but yeah, overall, cool. I think preference-wise, though, I do like the Pegasus deck a bit more. But yeah, this should make for some interesting plays. So, I mean, I haven't played too many speed duels, but I have played a little bit of Duel Links, and... If you're into owning some of the cards and playing the game like it was back then, uh, long before all the other XYZ, Pendulum, Synchro, all that, if you, if you like the simpler game, um, you may want to take a look. They might be harder to find. I don't know when they came out exactly, but it is a different game, and it is probably more, more for folks who want that older game feel. I yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you have any questions, comments, thoughts, feel free to voice it in the comments and let's chat. Anyways, take care. Nathan out.